motion carries, and we'll sign that now. <coughs> I need a motion to appoint Linda Wickman as Fiduciary Commissioner for the estate of Lily Kidd. So moved. Second. Motion, second. Being all yes, motion carries. I need a motion to accept the resignation of Charles Vance as a member of the Hatfield McCoy Trail Systems Board of Directors. Well, as I had talked with the commission prior to the meeting, I, ha I haven't resigned yet, uh, but if it's the um, commission's uh, will that I do so, I'll go ahead and resign. Okay, entertain a motion. So moved. I'll second. Motion and second to accept Mr. Mace's resignation. We appreciate the support you've done down through the last five, six years. Motion. All yes. Need a motion to accept the resignation of Neil Vance as member of the Hatfield McCoy Trail Systems Board of Directors. Uh, as I told the commission prior to the meeting, uh, Neil has resigned as a member of the board of directors. I forgot to bring his uh, resignation, but I will. I'll go ahead and motion to accept this. Second. The motion and second. All yes. The motion carries. Need a motion to appoint Ferris Burton Jr. and Kenny Ray Agins to the Hatfield McCoy Trail System Board of Directors. So moved. All second. Mm -hmm. Motion and second. Then all yes vote. I'm going to abstain on that vote. Okay. You're abstaining? I'm abstaining. Mr. Ramey, that yes for you? Yes. Yes for me. Motion carries. One second. Um, I need a motion according to the civil action number 10-C-075 that it has been ordered that Charles W. Brown's name be placed on their official ballot for the November general election for the office of the circuit clerk of Lincoln County, West Virginia. So moved. I'll second that. Motion and second. In all yes vote. Motion carries. I need a motion to schedule the annual shooting match for Saturday, September the 25th, 2010. No motion. Second. Motion and second. Oh yes, motion carried. Officially known as a turkey shoot. I need a motion to approve appointments. Stunning vacation Lincoln County Commission for Donald C. Whitman Clark of Fall. Beverly Hager as administrator of the estate of Deborah Lindley and Fred Price as executor of the estate of Henson Price. Dallas Dalton as executor of the estate of Sarah E. Dalton. Crystal McCoy as administrator of the estate of Vincent Craig McCoy. Helen G. Wiley is the Ministrix of the Estate of Ira Ed Vincent. Wayne Allen Cooper is the Ministrix of the Estate of Rodney Dale Cooper. Elizabeth Ann Cummings is the Executive of the Estate of Basil Jr. Cummings. Harold Roberts is the Administrator of the Estate of Donald Lee Roberts. Virginia G. Roberts is the Executive of the Estate of Sue Ann Roberts. Warren Lowe Sr. is the Administrator of the Estate of Sarah B. Lowe. Ronnie Fraser is the Executive of the Estate of Doris Lee Fraser. Anna Louise Aldridge as executor to the estate of Kent Jr. Aldridge. Myrtle Dalton as administrator to the estate of Winfrey Dalton. Sarah <coughs> Paul as administrator to the estate of Tammy K. McGrady. Johnny A. Kaiser as executor to the estate of Loretta Faye Kaiser. I'm in. Second. Motion and second. Being all yes. Motion carries. I need a motion to reopen the estate of Henson Price's request to that Fred Price for the sole purpose to cash settlement checks. So moved. Second. A motion and second. In all yes, motion carries. I need a motion to approve a drawdown request number two in the amount of $219.51 from the community participation grant program for the crime watch. Mm -hmm. E.F. Charles S. McCann, President Authorization to sign the stated documents. Second. Motion and second. In all yes. Motion carries. I need a motion to reappoint Thomas Bowen to the Lincoln County Solid Waste Authority retroactive to July 1st, 2010 through June 30th, 2014. So moved. Motion and second. In all yes. Motion carries. I need a motion to approve an Allen Town Travel for Allen Holder Director of the Lincoln 911 to attend the 2010 AHC Regional Public Safety Communication and Inter- Operability workshop to be held in Delaware on September the 7th through the 9th, 2010. So moved. What, what does the county get out of this? Just his training and his knowledge. And we pay for it out of his. Well, his this year's supposed to be reimbursed. If there's a letter in um, your file there stating that it will not cost the county anything, that it will be I'll reimbursed. Second. There's a second. 
And all yes votes. <coughs> motion carries. Okay. Any public comments. Anyone in the audience that's not on the agenda that would like to speak at this time? Commission concerns? I have a couple of them. One is we've had a request since the, we approved the plan to have dumpsters put out in the community, and, and that's from the Ranger area, wanting the dumpster up there. So this map of updating, I think we'll work to get that taken care of. We had <coughs> the other thing is, uh, with all of the uh, matters and issues that we've dealt with down to since the primary election, um, it just um, might be helpful uh, looking at it from the county commission's perspective anyway. And Mr. Whit and he and I have talked, talked a little bit with the prosecutor that um, if we could um, come up with working with maybe the Secretary of State, maybe some others to um, come with a better uh, game plan, and better guidelines, uh, a way of dealing with the election process. It is confusing and, uh, uh, and it's just not good for our county to uh, uh, do anything that would appear to be improper, that would maybe disenfranchise people's vote, whatever. It just uh, seems to me like it. I know that I've heard Natalie Tennant on the news say she want to have a blue ribbon committee to uh, look at the uh, election process and maybe even change some laws and things like that. Well, that looks like it to me. Uh, we should do something here if we think there's some way we can improve uh, working with Mr. Whitten and the prosecutor that we can set out to do that and make it happen by the November 2nd election that we just try to look at ourselves and say what can we do better and uh, if it means more training for the staff to deal with election or whatever that may be but it seems like it uh, uh, we should take the lead to do that as a county commission I would uh, ask Jackie first if he came maybe some other lawyer come in and those uh, election laws help us but some way we need to look at ourselves and uh, 